not a good time for the legacy of Michael Jackson. You know that this is something I've spoken about on the show before and have been criticised, but this documentary, Leaving Neverland, which uh, got its Sundance premiere, is finally, because I think this has been a long time coming, giving a voice to the victims of Michael Jackson, and they were victims. But here's what Jermaine Jackson had to say about the situation on Good Morning Britain. We lost Michael, we lost our father, we're still mourning, we lost, we lost a lot. Just leave us alone, leave him alone, let him rest, please. But no, Lorraine, rest. Yeah. But, yeah. but no, Lorraine, I know this is his brother who is still grief stricken, but we cannot let this rest because there are victims here and they are not letting Michael Jackson rest. I get really angry about this. It was just last year, the 60th birthday of Michael Jackson, where a whole load of companies wanted to make a whole load of yes. money off his legacy. Yes, the do. legacy of a paedophile. And there are celebrities who still got behind Michael Jackson as recently as last year. Drake, who did a song which went to number one in the charts. Usher, Mark Ronson, all at this celebration. And look, I'm not saying, look, I know it's difficult, but and I'm not saying you can never listen to a Michael Jackson song again. Because he was an, an he amazing, was, an was, amazing star. He was an but incredible artist. There's a dark side well, there. Well, absolutely. But everybody knew about but, it. He was my, hiding in plain yeah. sight. Everybody knew. Well, he was. And, and what I guess I'm saying is not that we can never listen to Thriller or Black or White or Man in the Mirror. They are songs that stand the test of time. It's yes. about making more money off his legacy, releasing new songs doing more commercial ventures that has to end in this era it has to end and there are many many people men you know now whose lives were severely affected yeah. by michael jackson and i know people often say he was never found guilty in a court of law that oh, is true a lot of people were paid off though. that exactly Maybe. exactly in exactly the same way that harvey weinstein paid people off so we know how we feel about his legacy now. I know it's a tough one for people to get their head around. It's really hard. But remember, you know, this documentary has uncovered that old interview footage of Latoya Jackson, mm -hmm. Lorraine, saying that her mum had discovered that there were payments to families of kids who had allegedly slept with Michael Jackson back in the day. So so this is going to bring up yeah. some very uncomfortable memories. I have to say to Jermaine, I totally disagree with you. You are not letting the memory of Michael Jackson rest until you do. These victims have a right to be heard. I really want to see that documentary, and I think we all want to see it, and then we can make up our, our own minds, because he's not here anymore to speak up for himself. Fern Cotton.